Terry Bergen. Welcome to The Entertainers. Welcome to Real Time. Today I'm sitting talking with the most beautiful women in the world, <laughs> Laura and Natalie. Hi guys. Hi. How are you going? Now, uh, Laura, Laura and Natalie are from Groovology. Now without me sort of trying to be uh, the guy who knows everything, Molly Meldrum or something like that, Laura, <laughs> can you tell us you know, a, a little bit about Groovology? Um, well, it's it's uh, it's been going for a little while. Um, this band, it's it's new-ish, but everyone in the band has been playing for years. So probably everyone's been playing for 10, 15 years or more. Some probably twenty. Mm -hmm. Guitarist case. Um, so it's like a group of really um, professional musicians that have just come together to form a great band, and we go out every weekend and do covers and do functions and events and. Wow, and what a band. I mean, the, the two fantastic singers. <laughs> The thing I love about our band is that there's only three actual musicians on the stage, apart from myself and Laura, yeah. um, and it sounds like you've got a 10 piece band. <laughs> When you're out doing a corporate event, um, as event land out there, we're talking to the wonderful people who book events. Now, why you think, maybe I'll direct this one to you, mm. why should they book you guys? <laughs> I already know because I've seen you playing. Why should they book us? Um, they should probably book Groovology because we're seasoned you know, professionals, as Laura mentioned, um, and we like to have a good time, we're respectful. Um, especially with people's time and just making yeah. sure that the job gets done in the least, with the least amount of stress. I really but yeah, it's, I guess it's all about you know making sure that people have have a good time, especially with corporate events and functions and weddings and that sort of thing. Like everyone is um, always already ready to you know, go out there like it's their Christmas party or it's their you know, yeah. company event and they're kind of ready to go um, with their drinks and after they've had their dinner or whatever. So it's just sort of our job to make sure they have a good night. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful unison with uh, you know with the balance of um, yeah, Thank you. obviously there's a difference in your voices yeah. um, you know you've got a, a, a chilled out kind of thing and you've got this big whoosh, instrument so there but I like one. the way yeah I love the way you <laughs> but it works you, it works you know? beautifully. <laughs> With regards to your song list and song sets, is that up to the client? We can work with them, like to, to sort of um, come up with what they want. And I mean, that, that happens a lot with corporate events and weddings, you know, they might have specific ideas about the yeah. kind of songs. We're definitely open to catering to the client's needs and um, 
you have a wide range, right? So yeah. I noticed you were doing uh, rock and roll by Led Zeppelin. Mm -hmm. the last, you know, 40 years or so, like from, from the, the 70s or 60s, 70s or maybe even before and beyond, so it's, it's a real wide range that we, that we do, and it really depends on the crowd. It is this, I noticed uh, there was uh, that song by Bruno Mars. Yeah. <laughs> Um, well, I think even like I think even before the gig starts, um, we have um, a lady who book, books our band all the time, and will talk to the venues, um, and, and t yeah, and talk to all of those um, those sorts of people, and sort of work out a lot of their requirements beforehand as well. So she's she's really 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 good at she sort is, of, um, she's very good working with people and finding out like where we can bring our gear in and what sort of songs they want and the times for the night and all that sort of thing. So she sort of does a lot of that um, before we get in as well. And saying all that, we're pretty flexible within ourselves as well. Like yeah. there, is, there will always be a guideline that we have to stick to, but you know, situations arise that are out of anyone's control and we just jump on it and sort of try and fix it. Or, you know, if, like for instance, if, if we're running over schedule or under time, we can extend or, you know, cut off. Yeah, fantastic. And sometimes people want to do things on the spur of the moment as well. Yeah. Like so that, you know, if it's a corporate event, they might say, okay, we've got an extra person who wants to do a speech or something like that. So we just kind of accommodate um, their needs and just work around. <laughs> I'm here.